And I have it right here. I am holding it in my formerly nicotine-stained fingers. The Washington Times is reporting that feminism may be dead. At least in this way, 72% of Americans say they are not feminists. It is likely disappointing news for old school bra burners and glorious Steinem inspired feminazis. A new economist YouGov poll released yesterday asks, has feminism become a dirty word? Feminism's a mixed bag in the eyes of most Americans. Well, there's a line there. <laughs> feminism is a mixed bag. <laughs> Overall, 28% consider themselves to be feminists. 72% do not. Now, let me ask you, ladies and gentlemen, who do you know that for 25, actually 28 years, but 25 on the national stage, has been pointing out the truth of militant left-wing feminism? It is I, El Rushbo. Could it be said that years of properly defining modern era militant feminism has proven fruitful now this is not to say that they haven't done a lot of damage they have done tremendous amounts of damage but at least right now it ain't cool to be called a feminist now it doesn't mean there aren't feminists out there because there are a lot of republicans it ain't cool to be called a conservative a lot of conservatives who will not tell you that they are right now that's not necessarily good there are a lot of conservatives afraid to be. So it doesn't mean that there aren't a whole lot of feminists. What it means is, this poll, is that there are not very many people who want to say they are. And I'm still going to chalk that up as a success. Among women, 38% consider themselves feminists. Men do not appear to be very liberated these days, either 18% accept the label feminist for themselves democrat republicans uh, women see the word differently 48 percent of democrat women but just 14 percent of republican women would label themselves feminist and things are not so promising even among those females who grew up in the 60s and 70s back during the bra burning era and the story mentions that that's not me that actually did happen. It wasn't that widespread, but it did happen. It was an identifying aspect of the era. Women over 65, 28% say they're feminist. Gen X women, 30 to 44, 32% say they're women. Millennials age 18 to 29, that's the age group of women scared by me, 42% say that they're feminist. It is negative associations people carry regarding feminism that causes Americans to shy away from the label. People twice as likely to consider calling somebody a feminist to be an insult, that's 23%, rather than a compliment, 12%. There has been one person, I mean, one, a lot of people here and there, now and then, whispering one person has been shouting from the rooftops warning about this movement it is i l rushball and it might be said that i have succeeded in stigmatizing and this is why by the way they're constantly coming after me because it's effective